everyone and welcome to Camp Creativity. My name is Isabel Carbonetto and I am a Girl Scout cadet working to earn my Silver Award. The Silver Award is the highest award that a Girl Scout cadet can earn. For my Silver Award, I have created this virtual summer camp, Camp Creativity, where kids of all ages can make cute crafts and learn some interesting facts along the way. Camp Creativity will be five days long and we'll have one craft for each day. But since it's all virtual, you guys can do these crafts at your own time and pace. And feel free to come back to these videos later if you ever want to make one of these crafts again. The theme for this video is jellyfish, so we are going to be making a swimming jellyfish. And what it is is a little jellyfish on a plate and you can make it swim around. A fun fact about jellyfish is that they aren't actually fish. Um, they're classified as invertebrates, which means that they don't have backbones. And one more interesting fact is that scientists believe that the first jellyfish are actually older than the first dinosaurs. So with that being said, let's start making the craft and feel free to pause the video as you need to. Okay, so to start making the jellyfish, you're going to take your plate, your paint, and the sponge brush. You're gonna take your paint and start painting the inside of the plate. I'm gonna paint just around this circle here. So you see the circle on the plate? I'm just gonna start painting inside there. So once you're done painting your plate, it should look something like this. And while we wait for the paint to dry, we can start working on our jellyfish. So for the jellyfish to make it swim, we are also going to have to paint this popsicle stick. So once again, take your paint, on your paintbrush and paint the hopsicle stick at least like three quarters of the way. So just about there. And then you can set it aside and wait for it to dry. So to create the jellyfish, you are going to take your pink paper and your pencil, and you're gonna use these two corners of the rectangle and draw a semicircle to create the jellyfish. And your semicircle should look something like this when you're done. So once you finish drawing your semicircle, you can take your scissors and cut the jellyfish's head out. Once the jellyfish's head is cut out, it should look like this. And the next thing we're going to do is make the jellyfish's eyes. So you're going to take the white sheet of paper and your black marker, and we're going to draw the eyes. So what you're going to do is draw two little circles. Make sure they're the same size and then draw little semicircles in the corners like this and then cut them out. Once the eyes are finished and cut out, you can take your glue stick and glue them on and then you can take your black marker and draw a little smiley face. Once that is done, you can take your strings and your jellyfish, flip it over, take the strings Spread them out accordingly on the back of the jellyfish as you want them to look. And then just make sure they kind of all line up at the bottom here. And then you can take your glue stick and glue them on. So now that your strings are glued on, you can take the popsicle stick, which the paint should hopefully be dry by now. Flip the jellyfish over, take your glue stick, put the glue on the back of the popsicle stick, and press it on. So now you have your jellyfish and now we have to work on the plate. So to actually get the jellyfish to swim, we are going to have to cut the plate. So if you, it's a little challenging. So if you want to ask a parent for help, go right ahead. So what you're going to do is take your plate, kind of fold it in half like this, and then take your scissors and you're going to have to cut just a little like slit in the middle. Kind of like that. And then when you unfold it, you can take your scissors and just cut a line straight across. Like, kind of like that. And then you can slide your jellyfish in. 
and you're all done. Well, that's it for this craft, and I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day, guys.